Hello my little butterflies and this video is going to be my August wrap up coming to you via webcam because I'm too lazy and too tired to go get my camera out of the room because I had to fight with Khalid for her to go to sleep and take her nap and I don't want to risk waking her up to go in there and get it so here we go. Um, I'm exhausted y'all. Like, I worked all day today. I lost my voice. I'm just starting to get it back. I'm about to work six days in a row with no day off. I was off Monday that just passed. And I'm not going to be off again until Monday coming up. So, yeah, they're working me like a Hebrew slave. And I'm not, I'm be honest, I'm not loving it. I, of course, y'all can say, well, you getting money. Yeah, okay, I like the money. But it's taking time away from my me time, from my career time, and from my reading time, which is part of my me time. So, I'm really not liking it. But um, this is just going to be a quick wrap up because I didn't get a chance to read much in August given my crazy ass work schedule, my crazy ass employers thinking I'm a damn slave. But um, I only read two books in August, which isn't bad because I think that's that's great with my schedule. And um, I'm currently still reading one book that I wanted to finish this month. But given that it's the 30th, there's no way I'm going to be finished this Unless I really sit down tonight and actually reread, which is probably not going to happen. But the first book that I read in August is Bad Girl Gone by Temple Matthews, which is a book that I got from NetGalley. And I also want a physical um, advanced, cop, advanced reader copy from Goodreads and a Goodreads giveaway. I gave this book a 4 out of 5 stars. I didn't make a video review for it, but I did do a review on my blog for it, which I'm going to link in the description. And I also uh, put a piece of my review on Goodreads, so it makes no sense for me to put that link on unless you just want the link to the book. But I'll put both of them in the description box below. Check out my blog to see my full review on this beautiful, amazing book because I really did love this book. Like This book kind of reminded me now, look, I've never seen the movie, but Lovely Bones. I saw the trailer for the movie, and it's kind of, like, gets you the feels of that. I want to see the movie, but I just bought the book, like, a couple of months ago in my postpartum book haul, and I haven't read it yet, so I want to read it before I watch the movie, which is really old, but, you know, this is really good. Um, the second book that I read in the month of August was actually a graphic novel, and it is called, it's The Black Panther. I don't know if you guys could be, this one right here, um, I want to make it bigger, but it's going to go to the book, and I don't feel like doing all that, but I really like that. I think I gave it a four out of five stars as well. It was really amazing. This is the first time I read about The Black Panther. I don't. Don't jump on me. Like, I always heard about the Black Panther, but I didn't personally know anything about the Black Panther. I didn't, like, ever read anything about him, or I don't even know if they have any movies about him, but I've never even seen any cartoons, you know, with him. I, I've always heard, I knew he was a hero. I've heard about him, but I never really, you know, went to actually see about him myself. And I absolutely love this graphic novel. I also did a review for this on my blog, so I'm going to post that. Um, in the description box below so you guys can go and check my blog I'm trying to send some traffic to my blog and no that doesn't mean all of my reviews all of my reviews are on my blog but that doesn't mean i'm not going to do video reviews to books too it's just when i don't feel like doing a video review i'm gonna just send it to my blog so that way i still have a review up somewhere even if i put a video up i'm still going to have a written review on my blog so you guys can always go and read it if you want to read it versus hearing me talk about it or both whatever you know whatever the deal is um but yeah those are the two books that i read in august and the book that i'm currently reading that i wanted to actually finish this month is a justified bitch by hg mckinnis and this came out August 8th, along with Gone Girl, I forgot, sorry, it came out August 8th. But this came out August 8th. This is also a book that I received from NetGalley, but I also received the physical advanced reader copy from the actual publishing company. Yeah, but um, I'm really actually loving this book. I've been trying to get some reading in with this at work. And you know how it is when you're not doing anything? No one, like, bothers you, but the second you start doing something, everybody comes to bother you. That's my struggle trying to read this at work. Because like, I can be sitting at my register for, like, an hour. Nobody will come. The second I take out this book, the 61 minute that I decide to take out my book and read it, somebody comes up to my register and all customers had this just, <sighs> this favorite line they like to get. Oh, you look like you need company. Do I really, when I'm reading a book, I, and it's not, it's not like I can tell you go away, because technically I'm supposed to be working anyway, that's my job, 
But it's just, it's irritating. Don't come up to any cashier and tell them it looks like they need company. Because I promise you, it's irritating them. Don't do it. Okay? Just be like, how you doing? And put your stuff on the belt. And let's keep it going. But... I'm really trying to read. I read the bulk of this um, last night, actually, while I was at home. I'm think, um, according to Goodreads, I'm 53% done with this. I'm pretty sure. 50, 53%. But I'm really enjoying it. I'm really liking it so far. It is a murder mystery. I don't think the cover does this book justice so far. Like, I'm, um, I guess I understand where the, the chain link Vince thing is coming from reading the book but it could have been a better cover but the book is actually pretty good I like the title of the book but it's so weird when I'm reading this at work and then our customer comes up so I put it up like oh what are you reading and I can't say I mean the justified bitch I have to be like oh it's about a murder mystery <laughs> and it's like I want to tell you the title because if it sounds good I really want you to go read it but then again I can't be cussing to the customers and be like it's a justified bitch I don't want anybody to get offended or anything so then it's got to be oh well, it's about a murder mystery <laughs> you know it's kind of awkward but I really love the name of this book because I don't have any books like with this name on it like I really love this but it's it's really amazing so far, and I'm halfway through, so that says a lot when you're halfway through, and you can say that it's a really good book. So hopefully the rest of the book goes really good, too, and I'm kind of itching for, like, something else to happen, because in the description box, there are apparently two bodies, so I'm ready for body number two to drop, and I'm just, I'm ready. And I guess this is supposed to be part of a series. I think this is supposed to be part of a series. I don't know how many books. I don't know if it's three books, two books, four books. I don't know, but it's pretty good so far. So, guys, thanks for watching my webcam August wrap-up. Like, thank you guys so much. Um, Y'all know I like doing webcam videos. I don't know why I don't do them more often, but you know I love to do webcam videos. And also, since fall scents are starting to come out candle-wise, and Bath & Body Works is, like, really trying to reel me in. I have gotten so many coupons from them sent to my email. Oh, fall scents are on sale already. And y'all know I, I got to go get me some more pumpkin, like, scented candles because the one that I had that I got last year is like to the bottom like it's ridiculous I think it's pumpkin I'm burning it right now I think it's pumpkin pecan waffles and it smells so freaking amazing but I need to get more so when I get paid be looking for like a candle haul because I, I don't know if I can control myself and go in there and just get just one you know I have to stock up me I know I love fall time so I have to stock up with the scents so, um, yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about. Thank you guys for watching my video. I know I look a hot mess, but if you stayed this long, apparently you don't mind. So, thank you very much. And just tell me I look beautiful. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, share, and you know what? No, don't share this video. <laughs> but like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Bye.